up, you guys? Marty Schwartz here from GuitarJams.com. Hope you're doing great out there. Uh, heavily requested tune, and I'm going to give it to you guys right now. It's really fun, one of my favorites. Uh, just all blues, really cool blues techniques, kind of turned and in, wrapped up into a rock song. Great stuff. Uh, also, I have some classic blues licks that are DVD quality. Uh, that are not on YouTube, and you can get access to those licks right below this box. Click the link right down there and check it out. I really appreciate it. But in the meantime, we're going to zoom in and break this one down right now. Here we go. So we've got this kind of Land of A7 blues vibe that's in lots of guitar playing. plucking or a pick either way you're going to be able to do the same thing listen to the sound hear, hear it in your head da, 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 da. so we're going to do that with an a power chord So that's the first little variation. There's some variations. We got, uh, you know, I was using my fingers there, which I think is a little more authentic in that opening sound, but then later it's strumming away. But either way. And so that's pinky on the fifth fret of the D string. So let's pretend everything was just the D string. Uh, you know. So if you're looking at the uh, G string, it's that fifth to the second as well. So A, 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 A. that open A when you're doing that. as I do. Or, same thing on that D string while I'm holding the chord. Other one. 
one, which is when the distortion kicks in. So if I just look at the A string. Instead of the O, it's the A power chord. And it also does that when the singing comes in, like the second time when he's singing, it, it changes from Another technique that's really good to practice is if I'm going down, up, 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 a good blues technique is to try and mute that down and then hear the up. It starts with a down A power chord. And when it's doing the, uh, those are the downs as well. But we want that, you just want to chuck it. solo, which I have actually a really cool lesson uh, on the techniques of that solo uh, in another video. I'll, I'll leave a link for it down there somewhere so you can check that out. But it's the same progression, but in C. So we go to a C power chord, which has got that root on the eighth fret. And then fourth on the A, sixth on the A, back to C. So forth and so on. Then we need this bridge, and it's another classic blues technique. Uh, we're going to keep pedaling onto the fifth fret of the high E. And then we've got this A power chord. So I'm, I'm doing a little hammer on from three to four on the A string. And it's going to that A root, which is the second fret of the G. But I'm just playing an A power chord, but we really want to hear that. To make sure we get it in there on the... So now, let me show you this other trick. It's going to be 5th fret on the D to 5th fret on the high E, like this. But then you, we're going to keep lowering that D string down a half step, so... going back and forth between the D and the high E. Do da 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 do
got something from it remember i've got those dvd quality blues lick lessons famous style in that link down there below this box i really appreciate you going down there and checking it out uh also just thanks for hanging out and watching me on youtube i really really appreciate it and i hope to see you in another one of these videos real soon see you later